This animation and video will explain firstly why we are running the Pioneer Study, secondly why we are inviting you to take part, and thirdly what taking part will involve for you. Following consultation with stakeholders and discussion with our patient public involvement group, we will use the terms pregnant woman or women and woman or women in this video. We wish for these terms to include people who do not identify as women but are pregnant or have given birth. Pioneer stands for Pravastatin to prevent preterm birth and it is a clinical trial. In this video, we will explain what Pravastatin is and what it would mean for you to be involved in this study. The Pioneer study is investigating whether taking the medication Pravastatin reduces the number of babies born before 37 weeks of gestation, which is also known as preterm birth. Around seven or eight out of every 100 UK babies are born too early, and this number has stayed the same for over 20 years. Although advances in care mean that babies born early, before 37 weeks of pregnancy, often do well in the UK, being born early, especially before 32 weeks of pregnancy, is the most common reason a baby may die before they reach their first birthday. For babies that are born early, it can cause lifelong difficulties. These problems are more likely to occur the earlier a baby is born, and extra days and weeks of ongoing pregnancy can make a big difference. We have developed Pioneer with women who have experienced a preterm birth, and they have shared with us that the impact of having a preterm birth can be huge and that even the possibility of having a preterm birth can be upsetting and worrying. The Pioneer study is investigating a possible treatment which may reduce the risk of preterm birth. We don't fully understand why some babies are born early and at present there are few treatments that can prevent this from happening. Research shows that it is likely that early labour may occur in some pregnancies because of types of inflammation in the pregnant woman's body. Taking a medication which reduces inflammation, such as pravastatin, could therefore reduce the number of babies born too early. You have been invited to take part in the study as you've been asked to attend the preterm birth prevention clinic. This is because your midwife has assessed you as having a higher chance than average of having a baby born too early. Pravastatin is a type of medicine called a statin. Statins are medicines that are commonly taken by around seven to eight million people in the UK each day to reduce the chance that someone will develop a heart disease, such as having a heart attack and strokes. Pravastatin does this by protecting blood vessels and reducing inflammation in the body. Studies investigating the use of pravastatin by pregnant women have not found any evidence of harm to babies or pregnant women who took them. Pravastatin has already been used in research studies with pregnant women to see if it can prevent a condition called preeclampsia. Preeclampsia leads to a rise in the mother's blood pressure and may have serious implications for both mother and baby. In these studies, women who took pravastatin had their babies at a later date in pregnancy than those who did not take pravastatin. There was no evidence of harm to babies or pregnant women who took pravastatin. The Pioneer study will test whether taking one tablet of pravastatin every day, starting between 16 and 20 weeks of pregnancy and continuing until 37 weeks of pregnancy, reduces the number of babies who are born too early. With your permission, we will take a sample of blood from you at the start of the study to help check if you are eligible to take part. If your blood test shows you are suitable to take part and you would still like to take part in the study, then you will be given either pravastatin or a placebo, which is a dummy tablet that looks like pravastatin but does not contain any medication. Equal numbers of pregnant women will be given pravastatin and placebo. Whether anyone taking part receives pravastatin or placebo will be determined by chance in a process we call random allocation. Neither the pregnant woman nor the researchers will know which tablets they are taking until the end of the study. You will need to return to hospital around a week after your initial discussion and blood sample to provide consent to the full study and be given either pravastatin or placebo. There will be one additional visit at 28 weeks of pregnancy to collect your second batch of pravastatin or placebo and to have a blood test to assess your liver function. For all study visits, we will pay for your transport and contribute to childcare costs to help make this easier. Your local hospital will explain the process of claiming for these costs. Where possible, we will hold the study visits at the same time as your other clinic appointments to avoid extra trips. 
There would be one extra blood test taken at the start of the study to make sure you are able to take part and a blood test at 28 weeks, less than two teaspoons of blood to check your liver function to make sure it is safe to continue taking the medication. We would make no changes to your usual care at all. You would otherwise be cared for in exactly the same way as if you were not in the study. For example, your doctor may recommend you have a cervical stitch or be given progesterone, depending on the treatment options available in your hospital. And this would not be affected by whether you choose to take part in the study or not. You will just be taking the additional tablet, either provostatin or the placebo, and have the extra tests and potential extra visits. As part of the study, we will also collect information on whether you have received any additional treatments to help prevent preterm birth. It will not affect your care if you choose not to take part. Participating in this study is entirely voluntary. When you attend your first preterm birth prevention clinic appointment, you'll be asked whether you would like to take part in the study by one of our research team. If you would like more information, then the research team member will speak to you either before or after your preterm birth prevention clinic appointment. We will answer any questions and explain the next steps. Within the Pioneer study, we have a mini study called the Information Study. This focuses on whether we can improve the information we give to women about taking part in the Pioneer study. As part of this, you may firstly be invited to agree to an audio recording being made with discussions between healthcare professionals and you about the Pioneer study. And secondly, you may be invited to take part in an interview with a researcher about your experiences of being invited to take part or your experiences of taking part if you decide to join the study. You can say no to the information study and still join the Pioneer study. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video. There is also an information sheet which has further details about the steps of the Pioneer study. Please contact us if you would like to know more information before your appointment.